That's Matthew Ottinger on, on the uh, soprano and all those other bits and pieces. This is uh, uh, an amazing thing for me because uh, these guys are all uh, working hard reading these, these little charts that I've printed out of my computer. And uh, I've got to take this opportunity to thank them because uh, I don't actually read music. And it's an amazing thing that technology can do to get the music out of my mind and put it on charts to, to bring it to life. Um, and it's been a, a great journey for me with this, with this, uh, this band to uh, explore the ancient old combination of just the pure acoustic sound of horns and drums. And uh, it's a very ancient sound that you can hear all throughout the world. Um, people kind of know it very famously with the New, New Orleans type sound. But uh, you can look in any culture. You can go to Europe, you can go to Africa, you can go to Asia. You can look and you can see this ancient uh, combination of of drums and horns. So I'm drawing references to all my favorite influences of, of that kind of music and also adding a new type of perspective to the, to the instrumentation, which is this tune is called Don't Fence Me In. And it was uh, written in inspiration uh, when I came back from overseas and there was this ginormous steel fence built around Sydney um, and uh, I just didn't uh, expect it and it kind of freaked me out. And this is a little tune called Don't Fence Me In. Funnily enough, it's influenced from programming and hip-hop, so we're going to do a horn drum version of some hip-hop for you. <laughs> 